Hi y'all folks, this is Josh from I have way too many sites to remember.com. I'm just giving Zenimax a hard time. Big shout out to him for making the H boot downgrade video for the Evo 3D. This video is gonna be on mean ROM for the HTC Evo 3D. Right now it's on version 2.5, which is like got to be one of my favorite ROMs. The last time I actually like did a full ROM as a daily driver was uh, from Viper Boy. But I, I mean, I really like this ROM. It's got a lot of crap removed. It's pretty fast. Go to About Phone. Me and ROM version 2.5. I don't know if you see that or not. It says it's supposed to be using the new Anthrax kernel, but I'm not seeing that on here. One thing is, like, when you press volume up and down, it's a red color in instead of the tr old color. And one thing I really like about this ROM is when you pull this down, you don't have the recent running apps. I have been a long time Android user since 1.6. So for a very long time, I've just held down the home button and selected my recent app that way. And I'm a huge Mod person, so I prefer Mod over Sense any day, but this phone doesn't have a Mod port that has working 4G and camera. Also, that's another thing, is it uses the Amaze camera. So I'll bring this over here. It's got like a little spinning thing that tells you if it's in focus or not. It's pretty cool. Then you can switch it to the front. <laughs> Oh, uh, get the phone back in focus. And switch it back to the normal camera. Or, okay, this is video mode. Switch it back to the... Of course, you can touch to focus, like always. And I believe in our messaging, you can also send multimedia messages. Yep, that are five megabytes, so it doesn't compress them. Now being someone that used to use battery indicator and add the little thing up here that told you how good your battery is, I do like the percentage at the top. Neat little percentage. Right now my battery is at 48%. I just did something that's kind of controversial and I wiped my battery stats. Some people say it's a bad thing to do and some people say it's a good thing. But I wiped them and I haven't gone through a full discharge yet. But I can promise you that if you follow me on Twitter, I have gotten exactly two days out of a charge. And that was actually using Plume and sending text messages with Google Voice and stuff like that. So actually using it. Not heavy use like playing non-stop video games or streaming video which is going to kill your battery faster. But as you can see right there, I right, turn this down. There we go, that looks better. 19 hours, 11 minutes so far, and I still have almost half a battery. I am not kidding you, this ROM is amazing. Now to be fair, yes, I am using the extended battery by CDO, and as you can tell, my phone has been through hell. With the normal battery that's on it, when you set it down, the camera is exposed and it can get scratched up and I think mine has already been scratched from before when I didn't have this but with this battery on it's protected and I like a good sturdy phone so the extra thickness of it is something that I actually enjoy even with the stock battery you should get pretty good battery life out of this ROM I should have taken notes and written down everything that I was going to talk about because I'm kind of going on the fly here, but when you hold down power, you do get the extra options. Like when you restart, you can actually go into bootloader or recovery. And that's another thing I'm going to demo here in a second is the startup and shutdown. I have HP 1.4 because when I got my Evo in July, I was following the Freevo forums and stuff and the temp route, and everybody said, do not apply official updates. So. Ever since then, I never have. I just took an all-in-one thing and updated my radio and the other stuff and left the old H boot on there, which is 1.4. There is a way to downgrade, and Zito Max made a video on how to do it. I'll link to that in the description. Huge shout-out to him. But now I'm going to go ahead and show you the reboot screen. I'm going to show you the little reboot screen they have on here. It's pretty awesome. I like it. It does this. 
over and over again until it boots up, which I really do like it, like I said. Alright, this is my little review of Mean ROM for the HTC EVO 3D. Again, it's version 2.5. Battery life is incredible. The speed is great. A lot of the HTC crap is removed. Overall, I highly recommend this ROM. And I'm the type of person that doesn't like flashing ROM after ROM after ROM on a phone that I use on a daily basis. This is what would Josh do in a mount. Quick note. I'm actually waiting for my doorbell to ring because my Transformer Prime just got fixed and it's supposed to come today. I'm going to unlock it and install some ROMs and make videos on those. Plus, I'm going to do uh, Transginger for the Transform and Transginger on Crack as well. So, lots of videos on multiple devices and not really enough time to do them all. This is what Josh do and this time I'm out.